I hope. So that be um, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year or whatever you want, sir. Because I am recording this on Christmas Eve. Yeah, peeps. This is just going to be a quick one hot, one hot shot, whatever you want to call it. Quick update. More updates. Yay! Anyway, let's get on with that intro since you've already had the other uh, racking intro. But hey, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever the fluff you are. Well, developments for my ear. Yeah. Did the MRI. Apparently they can't find anything there. So I've been discharged from one ENT. So after New Year, I will be cracking on, going back to the doctor, seeing if I can go to a different ENT. Since before I moved into Wigan, I was doing all right with the guys at Chorley, so I might try to see if I can get back onto theirs, or if they can find a way of getting me a different ENT specialist, not the one that I was seeing. Um, so there is that. Um, a bit pissed about that, but you know, what do you expect? Since a few of them seem to be, if it, if it isn't X, Y, and Z, basically mean if, if we can't see the infection, if it isn't cancer, and right now, if it isn't the, uh, Gilford, if it isn't Gilford, boy, that annoying C word, not cancer, the other one, if it ain't that, and they don't want no, which, what can you do about that? But yeah, I am double vaxxed. Don't really want to do the booster because after how bad my reaction to because the jabs was, I don't want to feel like absolute shart again. Even though half the time I usually do anyway. But moving away from that. Uh, right, so rugby. Should be going back to rugby whenever that starts, depending one, depending on what I'm doing with that. Two, depending on what happens. Uh, a little bit further down the line with the following on um, little thing. With the football stuff, I was hoping to be able to get to the FA Cup game against Blackburn. But with the impending possible lockdown, I don't know. Plus also, um, again, coming up later, there is also something there. So I might not really have the funds to be able to do a lot of the games. Especially because I still don't have a job yet, which... Hearing. I do have to wait for that before really I can um, comfortably jump back into a job. Yeah, as you can tell, my hair is still pretty goddamn long. So that should be getting played with eventually, if I can be bothered. Because I keep kind of forgetting. Yes, I do have the um, wolfy girl. Oh, sexy red riding hood wolf, whatever you want to call her. On there. This is quite an old shirt. But this ties into uh, the uh, next one up, which I might as well just go and do. So it looks like within the next, what, month or so, yeah, the 13th of January, the 13th of January, I will be going back to Sheffield. Yay! This one will hopefully, by what I've read in the script there, Hopefully this will be the talk about starting the hormone therapy, meaning I will not need to have my prosthetics for much longer. Yay! Two years behind. Well, three years behind if you uh, discount the um, global annoyance. But there was a, a delay because I set the delay because I moved. So that was me I opted to have a, de a slight delay because I moved and then obviously um, the um, global pandemonium or pandemic or whatever you want to call it kicked off so yeah the um, global experience wasn't exactly brilliant now was it but you know shit happens but okay that's that sorted uh, with this, obviously, still the same background. I'm not out and about like I wanted to be, but obviously because 
it's cold out there and I can't be bothered going out. You know, to do the roundups and stuff, so. I was going to do a roundup the other morning, but kind of wasn't really in the mood for it and then um, kind of was a bit annoyed with yeomans. I can't start yeomans sometimes. You know, us furries, we don't really like humans all the time. But hey, <laughs> we have to deal with them. Since it's, uh, since we have to inhabit the same human world and all that. But hey, there's that. Movies and all that. Really, I can't be bothered with movies. I don't know what I'm going to do. I was thinking of... Oh, I was supposed to be, obviously, going to watch in, um, Jackass. Jackass Fiwa, but they moved that, didn't they? They decided to um, hold that one off until next year. So Jackass 4, that's the game-wise. Nah. Have you... Give us a second. I can break it then. Yeah, where is it? Ah, there we go. Guardians of Galaxy. Been playing that for a while. It's a bit of a kick-ass game. So it's quite fun, especially when you're messing about with Star Lord. Obviously, most of the voices aren't the same. I think Rocket is the only one. If it isn't the exact same person, Rocket is the only one that is similar to or exact the same as. The rest of them are all a slight bit off, um, but it seems to take place after the. Thanos experience feels like it is right before the third Guardians of the Galaxy movie, however they want to call it. Guardians of the Galaxy as Guardians of the Galaxy. What the fluff ever. But you know, it's quite it's a, quite fun. A lot of fun. But it does have its drawbacks for some of the, the quick time events. Meh but you know. What do you expect? It's a Marvel game. It's a superhero game. It doesn't really matter that much to it. It's quite fun. And it is pretty fun. Huh? There's a lot of stuff mainly aimed at you. There's one part in there which some Warriors fans would be um, quite happy to know that um, the um, Warrior, Patty Smith, song that is in there because it's one of the things where star lord has to do a pep talk with one of the other characters and one of the ways to get through it is you start singing i am warrior so that one flows is that is a lot of 80s jam which yeah a lot of metal in there especially when you get kind of you know some of them going on it's like perfect timing the music as well, when you can judge it, is quite right. There's obviously going to be a few bits and pieces. Obviously, I'm still going to be singing the praises of Rift Apart, as that is my favourite game at the moment. No, I haven't started on that, which everyone seems to say is quite a bad game, but I haven't started it. It is installed, but I haven't started it. Really, it depends on what my mode is. As for the PC side of it, I am on Forza Horizon 5 quite a bit. So, because I've got it right there, you know, there is an Xbox One X sat under my second screen, which isn't plugged in at all. It's a paperweight, because the PC... The PC can hot foot it a little bit harder than that thing. The Xbox is probably going to get sold at some point. But I've kept it there just because, just in case I ever actually plug it in and ever find any games for it. Or if I want to play the 360 games, they're always there, which I don't really have any. Anyone that does any PS4 stuff and has played Biomutant, I'll probably be doing a play of that soon. I might eventually be able to start doing some live streams of stuff. At least I'm hoping anyway. But you never know. Depends on what happens because I've got to work some stuff out. I've got a little two to three year plan going. 
which eventually means a change of scenery. Eventually, I probably won't be living back with my parents. Eventually, I'm hoping to get my own place. Once I've got a job, got everything sorted, <laughs> you know. You know how that works, but that's part of the plan, is go through all of this, get all the medical stuff done, work out what I'm safe to do, get a job, get myself on feet, start doing things, look for my own place. It's because the way things are here is I have to work around everyone else. Because behind there, that's mum's room. So if I'm in here, I'm live streaming, uh, start streaming, let's say, at 10 o'clock at night here, and mum's got to go to work on an early, she goes to bed early. Meaning my noise has to reduce. And I can't just do that all the time with the headset, because I'm still yapping to you guys. So there has to be a little bit of flexibility. So my streams might end up being a bit earlier in the day like they were before. They might end up just being sporadic and kind of like wherever the heck I can get them in. But to get the most eyeballs on it, I have to do it later in the British timescales, which pushes the time boundaries. Plus, if I want to do a watch along of a Super Bowl or, you know, if I want to do the live stream at midnight here or whenever it is that the launch time is for a game and it goes live at a certain time and I want to be on that game having it downloaded and yapping to you guys I do need a little few things so bear with me on that to do with the rugby and football stuff just going to spin that back a bit anytime I can get to a game there's obviously going to be a vlog don't worry about that yeah because I'm going to be going to Sheffield I will be doing a, an on-site um, mini vlog which This thing will be going with me. That will be my on-site upload. It probably won't be as key as what's here. It's probably just going to be like, instead of it being edited with that splash screen at the beginning, it'll probably just be a quick hot shot, one loop, up it goes, boff, on. I might even try and see if I can do, um, you know, try and see if I can do a quick YT live if I'm able to, or it might end up being that you guys get a quick link just saying, join me here, and I'll be somewhere else. I might be Twitch, might be you now. I might end up just having to do it on Facebook, you know, just because sometimes I might not have the internet stream at the hotel that I'll be staying at to upload on the spot, and it might take a little while. So... Bear with me on that one. Games and stuff like that. If I do any, like, you know, Gran Turismo stuff, or if I do another playthrough of one of the games, you know, just grab one at random because I can't see what it is. Not sure you PS4. If I decide to do a Let's Play, just for instance of that, or what? Oh, I've got Sonic Forces in here. I've got Crash Bandicoot, Spyro, Saints Row. Guardians, obviously, another Ratchet and Clank, I've got all sorts in here. So, you know, there's bits and pieces I could be doing. You never know. You never know what future holds. You never know what's coming. But one of the things that I'm going to be trying to do, since I did have a look at it, yes, I do have um, an absolute shot glass here. Now, what I can do, as long as I don't do it that way, is I can do the, a shot of death on certain games. So you will probably see me go, clap, 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 done, yes, got it, wham, bam, off it goes. I might not be able to show you all of those shots on camera. But you'll definitely hear me whinging in pain. That's for certain. But anyway, I think I've prattled on a bit too long because it's almost getting at 15 minutes. Anyway, that has been me. Since eventually this thing and I know my voice might end up also um, moving along. I'm going to do a dual sign out since some of these videos will probably end up going on the sister channel. Now sister channel being um, the preferable word there it is the Vixen Warrior. Look it up. I'm trying to see if I can remind myself to put the thing in here. 
But that has been me, Kit Fox, 1387, aka the Vixen Warrior. That is me signing out. Peace.